with your daily YouTube live streams and more and welcome back to the best game ever. This is House Flipper here and it's a game all about buying, renovating and flipping houses to make money. This is episode 3 so if you haven't watched it from the start, if you want to check out episode 1, I'll have a link in the description below. Uh, we're already on episode 3 so last episode, episode 2, we actually bought our first house and sold it for $15,000 in profit. We made quite a bit of money, we now have $61,000 five hundred dollars to spend but uh, this episode is going to focus on uh, kind of renovating our office space here our office space was given to us it didn't have much it was just a complete hole in the wall at the start we already cleaned it up a little bit but it still needs a lot of work so we're going to be doing that today in addition to that we're going to be getting some more um some, some more points to level up our, our skills by, by completing some of these missions that we have here, including radiators, additional walls, and save me from these horrible colors, honey. There's a bunch of jobs that pop up. They give you money, and they also uh, level up your skills so that you can do things faster. So that's what's going on today. If you watch and enjoy this video, you love House Flipper, you want to see more of it on the channel, you want this series to shine. All you gotta do is smack that like button, easy as pie, smack that like button, tell a friend about it, and most importantly, if you are new around here, make sure to hit that subscribe button as well. And then you could uh, hit the little bell beside, turn on those post notifications, and you'll be notified every time I stream. Uh, it's pretty funny, because I was playing Fortnite, and just every person was requesting house flippers, so it made, me, it made me pretty happy, it made me pretty happy that you guys love this series so much, love the series as much as I love playing it, so let's go ahead and get this started, um, we have quite a bit of work here to do, uh, we got all of the outside to fix, we've got all of the inside to fix, and uh, we gotta determine how we want uh, this, this whole operation to go down, if you know what I'm saying, so we don't have much room to work with, but we can... We can make things work here. We can make things work. What's cool is that we actually have the laptop, and we can uh, pick up and move the laptop pretty much anywhere, uh, which means that we don't have to be stationary to the sort of this part over here. We can actually pick this up, and let's move this to, like, the floor. Let's move this just over here so we know where it is. And then we can, like, sell the desk. You know what I mean? We can sell the desk and sell the chair. But why don't we start with... Hmm. I feel like we need a fresh coat of paint or we need to do the outside. So let's go over here to uh, It will be is it? It's wall paneling. So uh, we can go ahead and do a Package of panels outside white. I, I feel like that's what we need to go with Because uh, it's either that or brick in the game and I feel like uh, the panels look a bit better So let's go ahead and buy those and and as we learned last time we're actually quite quick on placing them on the walls now so we kind of just go like that and we kind of do a super speed kind of do a super speed so we just have to do this all throughout this uh this area here wouldn't take too long but we need a nice finish on it you know we need to make our office inviting we need to have the ultimate office setup so i need all the suggestions you guys have should i have a gaming room in here should i have a bed this is an office so i feel like i don't need a bed do you know what i'm saying like we're not gonna sleep at the office. You could, you could potentially sleep at the office, but um, uh, I don't, I don't think we'll, we'll be going to be doing that. Also, it's only like a one-person office, so we can make it like half bachelor pad esque. Uh, in addition to uh, making it the office, I want to, I want to keep these posters because they look cool, and I don't think you can get these posters otherwise. But I also want to make it look clean because they look kind of torn up and stuff like that. But I, I think that it looks good. I think that it looks good. And I think it looks pretty great, um, so so we should keep it. Let me, let me put my oh, let me put my face in the other corner. There we go. This corner is a bit better, I think. There should be a gaming room, a gaming setup. I definitely agree with you there. So we'll go ahead and work on that. I just want to do the front side of this, and then uh, we're gonna go ahead and move to the inside here, because I don't want to do all of the paneling now. We'll do like half half, because I like switching up jobs. I like switching up jobs, but making sure that one side is fully complete, so that we know what it looks like, right? We know what it looks like going in. We know what it looks like um, when, essentially, when the whole project is completed, what it will look like uh, from the outside. So we got to go ahead and do these. Finish this up here. There we go. Just a few more panels at the top, and we should be good. One, two. Oh, there we go. Okay, we have a perfect amount to do one side there. Perfect. All right, so that's how, essentially, the front will look. We got to get some blinds on these windows though. We already know that. So why don't we go to the windows here and go to all, type in our windows, and we're going to go ahead and do the mountable window blinds open because I think they look the best. So let's go ahead and do that. Buy that there. And we have to mount each of these. 
I love how many windows all of these buildings have. They just have an immense amount of windows. So put that there, and then this one in the bathroom. Again, we'll get a, we'll get a closed one because we don't want anyone looking into the bathroom. I think that would be weird. I think if somebody looked into the bathroom, that'd be a little bit weird. I don't know about you guys. So I think most everybody would agree with me, but it would be a little bit weird. This bathroom is an absolute mess, by the way. I think we should maybe do the bathroom first. I mean, the bathrooms you can't you can customize a little bit, but you can't come out, customize a crazy amount. So we should probably do the bathroom first, and then we can get to the nitty gritty details of everything else. So let's go ahead and screw this in over here. There we go, and push that window in. Perfect. Let's assemble this last one. Or wait, there might be one more after this. Actually, let's go ahead and put that in there. And there we go. Yeah, we're definitely gonna have to buy a house in the future as well. Customize that for ourselves. I mean, but that's gonna be after a point where we already made enough money to sort of have that luxury. Because we don't, we have a decent amount of money now, but we're not like living large and in charge. You know what I mean? Okay, so we can give this a white coat of paint if we'd like. Um, this bathroom here. I think what we're gonna do is paint the walls white like we did at the other house. Because we have a bit of an experience there. And I think that white in the bathroom looks the best. And then we can do tiles on the floor. Um, so let's go ahead and go over to just a nice little white color over here. There we go. Let's get this paintbrush out. This paint roller, rather. And let's paint some walls. Let's paint some walls. These are dirty walls. We got to give it a nice little paint job here. Make sure everything's nice and clean. Now this, we got to put a sink, a toilet, everything in here. So we, we have a lot of space to fill. Um, with sort of utilities, which is going to be fairly interesting because I'm not sure I'm not sure how that's going to work out Seeing as um oh, wait, you'll, you'll see what I'm talking about. There's not much room and you have to put a shower and everything else in here So we will see how that turns out. We will definitely see how that turns out This bathroom looking a lot better already though We're just gonna paint over the tiles not weird at all. I don't think people paint over tiles like this, but you know what? It's going to be Gucci. It's going to be Gucci. You know me. So I like the minimalist look to things. I like things that are, are really cool and classy looking. So that that's the, the vibes that I always go for and that I aim for with a lot of these houses. I will go for different sort of changes though and get out of my comfort zone for a couple of different properties. I, like the ones that aren't even mine, we, we only have limited uh, things that we could do. But uh, with, with the ones that are mine and the ones that we could sell people and flip, um, we, we pretty much have free reign to go over that, so let's keep that in mind. Let's go ahead and roll that. There we go. And that's looking pretty sad. I'm just going to paint over this one, even though I'm not sure what will be the main color in this office area. But, um, yeah, this door is really, or these, these floors are really, really dirty. So let's go ahead and, uh, these are wall tiles. So we just need floor. So that will be floor panels and coverings. No, that will not be floor. I think it's, I think it's wall tiles, honestly. Now we went with, what did we go with last time? We didn't like this, oh no. Which one was it? Floor tiles, there we go. For some reason I didn't see that. Was it these that I liked? Let's see. These are bad. I mean, we can go ahead and put them and see how we like them. I think these are probably the best ones, I'm gonna be honest. It makes for like a clean sort of look to this. Should we make it blue the room? Like this whole office area blue? We could totally... What happened? Oh, okay. <laughs> I was concerned. I was like, what happened to my posters, man? I was trying to preserve them. Okay, so we need to put in the, the toilet and stuff like that. We want to get the best toilet for ourselves. Let, let's just be honest. We want to get the best toilet for ourselves. It's very, very important. Can you get like a bathtub in here? No. See, this place is too small to like accommodate a bathroom. But we're going to get... Let's get a mountable toilet flatty... What are the differences here? I like this one because it's expensive. You can buy a shower amount. Oh, this is where the toilet goes. Very, very interesting. Let's go ahead and put that. Let's assemble the toilet. This is how you assemble a toilet in real life. So if you need a guy to assemble a toilet, you've come to the right place, ladies and gentlemen. You've come to the right place. This is where you get your toilet. Your toilet guide. Uh, then there only seems to be one shower. I want to confirm by going all and typing in shower. There's only one mountable shower, so. And let me tell you something. I know from experience, this shower takes forever to mount. So we gotta go ahead and do all these little corners. 
all the little corners here, put that on the floor, and then this is where it gets crazy. This is where the half hour of shower mounting comes into play. So honestly, if you guys ever needed a shower mounted, I'm the guy to call. I know what to do. I know what to plug in. I know what to put down. I know what to install. I know what to screw in. I know what to screw out. Okay? And I know if it comes in nut color or not, which is very important. Because you know we like the nut color in this game. Alright, put those doors there. Yep. Put those screws all day, every day. Screw that in. Screw that in. <laughs> oh, goodness. You gotta, you gotta have a little handle here. There you go. And the other door, please. Thank you very much. Screw that all the way in. We gotta make sure things are fastened, you know? In real life, I make sure things are really, really jammed in so that I can never, I can never really unjam them, you know? It's kind of permanent. I do them permanently. <laughs> I gotta make sure that it's all, all well done. I feel like we didn't need, we didn't need a shower, but you know what? Just in case we get to the office and it's it's we're we're a little bit grimy, I feel like a shower is a little bit important, you know, just a little bit. We can we can decide if we want it after or not. Cause what else would we put there, really? What else would we put there? What the? There's a radiator? Oh, a towel radiator. We could finally get a towel radiator. Uh, so that'll be on. Let's go installations, multiple towel radiator. There we go. Let's assemble that. And screw that on over there. Perfect. Looking like a whole... This towel radiator is looking like a whole snack. Am I right? Looking like a whole freaking snack. There we go. We're going to have nice hot towels. I, I've only ever had an experience with a towel radiator when... It looks kind of ugly. Holy shoot. But you know what? This is my office, so I'm, I'm going to leave no, no expense unexpensed. You can put that in your English book right there. Um, let's go over to, we can do mountable sink. I kind of like this one. I mean, if we're going for this whole chic design here, might as well. I don't, do we have to, oh, we do have to assemble it. There we go. No garburetor in here either. Let's go ahead and put that down. Screw that in. So you can sell the posters. I don't want to sell them. They look pretty cool. I think they look pretty sweet. Okay, put that there. This is my favorite part. I like when all the parts come here. And then I gotta put all the parts together. There we go. Alright, that's good there. And then let's go ahead and get a mirror for the bathroom. I feel like you have to have a mirror for the bathroom. Forgot to put an R there in mirror. Don't worry, I know how to spell, guys. I know how to spell, don't worry. Trust me. Alright, I think that's pretty aligned. You're gonna have to trust me on this one. So that's there. And then what we're going to need is a, for the bathroom, we need a toilet paper holder right there. And then what should we, should we put pictures in behind them or what? Oh, we need a carpet. Remember we need uh what do they, what do they call it? Is it actually under carpet? There we go. Carpet. And then there was like a small, was it the granny one? Granny. Oh, that one's nice. We can put this one. Kind of like this one where it kind of covers the toilet, you know. Get nice, nice little vibes on your feet. That one's good. Mm. Okay, I feel like we'll have to add something there. Okay, let's let's. What way should we do this? I'm gonna go ahead and sell this desk. Now these tools here, we can just move them only. I think we're gonna sell that too. You can sell the chainsaw. You can remove essentially all this stuff. I'm curious though if you get to keep it afterwards. Like can you buy that stuff again? I'm not 100% sure. Now this floor, should I put, car I might put carpet in this, in this area. Like would carpet look good? Like should I just make the whole office carpet? I might just do that. Let's see what it looks like. It's not too expensive, so I don't mind, you know, testing it out with actual costs. Cause it's like seven dollars for that whole corner. There we go. I mean, that doesn't look bad. Holy shoot, these walls are dirty. Oh, they look very, very dirty. 
You need color? I think I feel like I do need some color. I don't have any lights in this place. Let me just do one thing real quick. Where is this right here? I just want to paint this really quick so that it doesn't look ugly. There we go. Let's get a light real quick as well. I do feel like the carpet has a nice look to it. Let's go ahead and get a light though. Ceiling lamps. Very, very good way of calling them what they are. Ceiling lamps. Um, this one looks cool. There was also like another lighting thing. It wasn't installations. It wasn't electronics. It was scones. Scones. Are those like outdoor things? Bro, I have no idea what a sconce is. Scones! It's a scones, baby. Um, I already assembled the toilet for those of you asking. We're just gonna put ceiling lamp cube for now. There we go. What's up with the smoke detector? Does it... Does it, does it give me the option to move it? Let me move you. You can't move the smoke detector. They're like, dog, we, we can't let you do that. I apologize. Let me get one of these sconces over here. Um, we'll get with the fluorescent light. Uh, that one looks good, but I feel like that's not going to go there. Any oh, dude, we should have like the posters and the lights above them. Oh, We got to do custom. We can do custom content in this game, too. So we have a bunch of different options. No problem at all. A little smaller fluorescent light might look pretty good there. Let's try this out. That looks pretty cool. That honestly looks pretty good. I think I might keep that. It's got like low key vibes to it. You know what I mean? Sconces. Again, I've never heard of that word before, so it's all brand news to me. Brand new news to me. All right, let's let's see what paint I should do then for the office. So let's go. Should we go with like a lighter? I feel like this is too blue, you know? I feel like dark blue might be a little bit, might make it feel hard to breathe in there too. But I feel like light blue is just too much. It looks like a kid's room. So I'm kind of, let, let's try this one. I don't know if it'll look good though. Is the light on? Let's turn the light on. Oh. I tried to just paint with a broom, so that's good. That's how my day is going. Should I make... Honestly, it might look good like this. I honestly think... I actually like this blue. So let, let's paint this wall and see how it looks. How it turns out. I swear my painting skills are slower now. I I feel like this, this color here has some office vibes. What do you guys think? I feel like the TG headquarters got to be blue. Ooh, new painting skills available. So we got, um, let's do, let's use less paint. Or should we paint three walls at the same time? Let's use less paint. Because then we could do things faster, essentially. I think this blue looks really, really cool. Let me know your thoughts. Like, I think that's like an office sort of blue. Or we could do blue and gray. Blue and gray might work really, really well. Blue and gray might work really, really well. I just saw a comment saying I'm in the hospital watching you, bro. Well, thank you for tuning in. I appreciate that. And I, I hope you get really better soon, all right? Big shout out to you, my friend. I didn't catch your name, but you know who you are. Big shout out to you, and I, I wish you all the best, huh? All Team TG is with you, man. All TG, Team TG is with you. So I think like a blue and gray would look nice. See, now the thing with blue, like a darker colors, is that you're always going to get like, um, how do I put this? How do I get the corner? I can't get that corner for some reason. I mean, you can't get the corner on this, this unit. There we go. I do like that we use less paint now. That's a good that's a good thing. So Ooh, wait, wait. Um Maybe we Okay, let, let's try the blue and gray vibes, okay? Blue and black might be a little bit too much for me, I think. So let's try blue and gray. I think just straight up gray would be good. Cause it's white and like faded lemon, but I feel like that's a little 
not my taste. So let's put the gray on. Let's go to our paint and let's load it up over here. And then let's do like this wall. That's kind of, I kind of like it. I kind of like, okay, we can always change it. Let me know what you think though. Let me know what you think. Like the two-tone blue and gray can be really, really good stylistically because I'm a designer. I don't know if you guys know, but I'm, I'm a house designer in real life. Uh, I've just designed for, you know, Oprah Winfrey, um, Shaq, um, Keanu Reeves. I've, I've designed for everybody. I'm, I'm the most professional house decorator out there. And, um, you know, this is a popular one out there. This is this gray design, so... Let's see here. We, we will see. We will see. I'm going to do it all. And then we'll focus on furnishing. And then we can change the color if we like. And then we can change the color if we like. It's not a big deal to change the color. It's pretty fast. Especially with her painting abilities and skills. Painting abilities and skills. All gray everything? Now would you prefer all blue or all gray? Let me know in chat. I don't think stripes would look good, but I guess you can make a point that stripes may look good. I don't think stripes would. I'm not, I don't know how I'm feeling about the, the gray, man. Like, it might be good. Maybe. We got to get a door on here, though, for sure. I know that. Go ahead and do that one right there. Get her done. A lot of people saying gray, a lot of people saying blue. Neither, there isn't neither. Let's give it a chance. Let's give it a chance and see how it turns out. There we go. So we got the gray and blue design here. Hmm. That's going to be a tough choice. It's going to be a tough choice. Um, not going to make a choice yet. We're going to leave it how it is for now and continue on to the next thing here. Or else I'm going to spend eight hours trying to decide. Let's put one more light here, though. And flick on these lights. Okay, so let's go ahead for now and sell these. I'm seeing a lot of blues, though. Maybe we'll make it all blue, then. Uh, let's go ahead, though, and buy a door, too. So let's go over to doors. And we need an indoor door. For the indoor back door door. Just kidding. We just need an indoor door. Um, honestly, like this mahogany color might look pretty good here. Depending on... Um, I I think I'm just going to go with white. Again, we could change it after. Like, let's see how this, this brown looks here. I think it's just too dark of a color. I think white goes with pretty much everything in here. So, there's a lock on there. Where it, there shouldn't be. Oh, wait, wait, yeah, yeah. Okay. These are kind of weird because I don't know if, who has a key to get into their bathroom. Who out there has a key to get into their bathroom? I wish they gave you more door options. I also feel like this door needs to probably change too. It's the right way though, at least. Oh, what the heck? When was this switch brown? When did that happen? Oh, everything's brown here. Do you see that? All the switches? Okay, so where do I put it? I can sell this coffee mug. There we go. That's going to go. I don't know what that is, but I feel like I should... Do you guys think I should keep all these little items and put them somewhere? Yeah, I feel like all blue might be a good thing. Hmm. Let me think. Let me drink my coffee and think here. All right, guys? There's, there's a lot of people talking. Hmm. <laughs> I was also thinking the floor, man. The floor, the floor is getting me right now. Okay, I'm, I'm gonna be real. I think the pine might look good on this house. Like maybe, but no. I don't know. 
floor dark panel. Oh, we should. We can make it a really classy looking office here. Should I make it a really classy looking office? What do you think? Again, this is really cheap for me to change. So like, don't feel bad if I change it and we don't like it. Like I can just change it back fairly easy. All right, so we're gonna leave it for now. And then we'll, we'll change it after. Let, let's go ahead and move these tools though. We're just gonna move everything into the bathroom. We're gonna move everything into the bathroom. We gotta do inventory, so we got two items. Because we, when we gotta move it all back, it's gonna be a struggle. So we got four in here now. We got five in here now. A little hatchet, we got six. Seven. The big chainsaw. It's gotta go somewhere, man. Ah, you gotta be kidding me. Uh, man, this thing doesn't go much places. This one might have some trouble, too. Actually, that one's good. Let's just try to make enough room for that uh, chainsaw to fit in here. Can you fit in now there, chainsaw? You mother trucking chainsaw. Come on, bro. I know you can. Alright, the chainsaw refuses to leave. The chainsaw refuses to leave. We're going to leave that in there for now. Okay, and then can we get rid of these little... How do we paint those over? Can you paint those over? I know there's an option for like, uh... Installations, maybe? See, modern light switch. I think that looks a lot better. We're gonna go ahead and sell this thing. There we go, and then this one can go... Oh, fudge. Okay, we got We actually gotta. I didn't know that, but you have to buy it where you want it. So let's put that right there, and then let's go ahead and sell that. I think that looks good there. We just need one light switch, and then um, in the bathroom too. Let's go ahead and. It sucks because I want to line up exactly where that one is. So let's do this one sell this one so it's a little more expensive this way but then we'll get exactly where we want it to be so let's go ahead and buy this one and put it here there we go there we go it's a little higher up but that's fine i like the way that looks okay i think that we're gonna make the office all blue but i did want to give it a different dynamic there just in case um, so with these posters too, I want to move them just for now. I don't know if we can get these posters anywhere else. So let's put these here. Because I feel like I feel like we should keep these. They're, these are the OG posters of the room. And this laptop is going to be really, really nice. So I think that this corner here should be our entire office sort of setup. Curious, can you... S oh, fudge. Didn't mean to do that. <laughs> I was just curious because it didn't pop up. I guess we can leave that for now. All right, let's see what kind of desks we can get. So we got classic desk, computer desk, corner desk, standard desk, desk, Anna. Let's see if we type in desk. Is there more options? Desk. Double cabinet with desk. Hmm. We do have a few options here. What do you guys think in terms of desks? What would be the desk of choice for you? Should we do the corner desk? Ooh, Alder. Oh, we can get a nut. Whoa, nut looks weird. What the heck? Why is nut shiny? Can we put it in sideways this way? <gasps> oh, it fits perfectly in there. Oh, that's awesome. That's okay. That might be the desk right there. I don't think we'll get a nut, but I think that this desk is. This desk looks good, right? Let's explore the... So that's the corner desk. There's also the computer desk, which does not come in nut. So just in case you were curious, it does not come in nut. This looks like a little little baby. This looks like a boss baby had a desk. Oh, you watch boss baby? This would be his desk. It's a desk for an ant. 
for a baby. This is just standard desk. Boring. This is just a classical desk. Makes me want to cry myself to sleep. You guys don't know how much I hate vintage stuff. I just want to let you know. I, I absolutely hate vintage stuff. I, I like It gives me the creeps. I don't know why. It gives me the creeps. So we're going to go with the corner desk. I think we can all agree with that. Why does nut look like metal though? Like nut looks weird. It shouldn't look like that, man. It should look like proper nut. Don't you think that it should look like a proper nut? Oh, that desk looks kind of cool. What do you think of that? That's a neat color. Why does nut look like this? What did they do to you, nut? What did they do to you, nut? <sighs> I think dark wood might be the... Ooh. Okay, it's up to you guys. Dark wood or alder? Dark wood or alder? Vintage is cool. Okay, not all vintage things. I'm going to take back my statement. Not all vintage things are whack. Is there posters? Power generator? What? <laughs> Wait, what? That's a thing. That's a thing you can buy? You can buy a fork, a safe. I feel like we need a safe. Ow, I just broke my hand. <laughs> I broke my hand live on stream. Thank you guys very much. I'm seeing a lot of dark woods. I'm seeing a lot of dark woods. My concern that it's a bit too dark. With light you could see it, but with dark wood it's so dark. I see one person still repping nut. But then again, I think this furniture style can get a bit tacky. Alright, I'm seeing everybody say dark wood. Let's go with dark wood for now if it changes. We could change our mind. Okay, that's as straight as it's gonna get. Alright. I feel like that's the perfect place to put the desk. I feel like Alder might be a better choice. I'm not 100% sure, man. I'm not 100% convinced. I mean, it might look better with all the laptops and stuff on it. So we're going to have the laptop here, right? Or we could have it to the side. We can have it like I have in real life. So we could do like laptop to the side here. Okay, wh whatever we go with, whatever color. I, th I, th I feel like it's too dark. The nut color. Okay, I'm going to buy it just so you guys can see. The nut color is metal, dude. We can't have metal. How much did I just spend to do this? 242. How much did I spend to buy it? I lost 60 bucks on that. I think I'm going to go with Alder, guys. I feel like that's what we're going to do. Nut looks too dark. We already checked out nut. And it's too dark. Why don't we go with uh, lamps? Like, will this lighten it up enough so that it looks proper? I'm just going to check. No. <laughs> it does not lighten it up. I think we got to go with Alder. I was a fan of the dark one, man. I was a fan of the darker one, but I feel like Alder might be where we have to do it. No it! Let's move this. Alder is too outstanding. Change the lighting. This one's is this is might be the toughest choice we've had to make in this game.
Alder clashes so badly. Okay, let's take one more luck. This is it. We're not going to spend any more time on this. We're going to take one more luck. This is Alder. I want your final votes in chat. Do you want Alder? Or do you want Dark... I was going to say Dark Nut or Dark Wood. Alder or Dark Wood. Lock in your chances now. I'm only picking between those two. Yeah, I'm only pick picking between those two. I don't know why you pick like a chrome color for it. Let me know what you think. Honestly, because if, if I can't decide, I'm picking nut. And we're going to have to be happy with nut. I think I'm seeing more dark. It's always hard to see because chat goes so fast. Okay, here, I'm just gonna count. I'm gonna stop it and count in three, two, one, boom. Alder, dark, alder, dark, alder, dark, 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 dark. I think, I think dark works. We're gonna go with it. If it doesn't work, we'll change it after. I should have not sold it in the first place, I guess, but it's all good. We're gonna work with it first, see, see how it turns out, okay? Bro, this thing is like one millimeter. There we go. Okay, so with this, we should probably get like a, we should get like a monitor. So like a uh, home electronics. What is a uh, uh, computer? F oh, oh, this is tower. Oh, that's perfect. We should get like a tower underneath, right? Okay, so that's that's one computer there, and then we should have our streaming PC too. This is exactly how my desk is looking right now in real life, by the way. Like, the computers almost look similar, too. Okay, so we got two PCs there. Um, let's go ahead and get a keyboard. We need a keyboard. There we go, wireless keyboard. And then let's go ahead and get a... Oh, there's a monitor we can get. Ooh, monitor works. That's a big monitor. Chase. Monitor HD. Oh, uh, that's way too big. I don't know who has that kind of monitor in their office. Um, we can do a hanging TV. We can have like we can have chat on the screen over here, bro. We're gonna have chat on the screen over here, or we can have chat behind us on a vertical. On a vertical thing right there. That'd be pretty sweet. This could be our live streaming setup as well. I think that we should go with, for now, let's go with the monitor here. Alright, put it right in the middle. Okay, so then we need a mouse. Let's go and get a computer mouse here. Too bad you can't get a mouse pad. That'd be pretty legit. And then we need the laptop. Where do we put the laptop? Laptop can go... We can put it to the... Should we put it over here or on the other desk? So we can have it like there. And that'd be a sort of complimentary setup. Or we could have it right beside it. Which might be a better organizationally for the office. Dual monitor. We should have a coffee maker on our desk. DVD player. Can we, can, we, can we just shove a DVD player? Who uses DVD player anymore? If anybody sends me DVDs, I can watch them, I guess. If you want to. It kind of looks like a console. Like, maybe we should keep that as, like, a console. A dual monitor would be cool. I'm going to be honest. Dual monitor would be cool. A fan? I'm a biggest fan over here. Is there, like, a printer? Because some of you guys mentioned a printer. Let's see. Let's see. How about, like... Printer. No. Would it be a, like there might be some under survival or something? Box. Pack. Oh, we can do like packages on the desk and stuff. Eh, that doesn't look the greatest there. Uh, what else do we got here? Reinforced door. What? Wait, what? You could have a fallout shelter. Oh, what? You can buy a gun. 
Oh my gosh. That's horrible. I mean, it's not horrible, but it should be in a gun locker. Unless it's a fake one. Could I have a hat. Dual monitor. Jar of soup, nuts, knife, macaroni. Where would this go? Oh, you can mount it on the wall. Holy shoot. That's really cool, that update. You have sewer grate, a switch. Okay, then. Toilet paper. Water container. Water bottle. I feel like a water bottle would be nice on the desk, you know? Packages are fan mail. Oh, we need a chair. A chair for sure. Hold up. We need a nice office chair. I think this one's good. You should make a fallout shelter house. I think that's definitely something we got to do. Definitely something we got to do. Let's put this office chair here, though. Oh, that looks pretty sweet. You should put the safe. The safe would be a cool addition. Let's do, um, can we do a, is there like a small, small black box? We could like keep our files on the desk or something. The ultra wide monitor, I don't think would work very well. Oh, notebook with recipes. Honestly, this looks like a folder. That looks cool. We'll keep that on the desk. Keep ourselves organized. What else do we need? A safe would be cool. A safe would be cool. But like, where would we put it? Under the desk? I don't think it really... Oh. Uh, should we put a safe right there? That would be pretty awesome. I think we do it. Oh, you can like glitch it into the desk. Alright, safe or no safe? Let me know in chat. Security monitor. Oh, speakers. Speakers would be good. We should get like a coffee maker on this desk here. Like we need to make some coffee, right? We should have a coffee maker and a microwave. Or we could have like a little kitchen area over here. Like with a fridge and stuff. That would be pretty sweet. Like you want that in the office. You want to feel comfortable. You want it to be convenient. You know, like that. All that jazz. All right. Everybody's saying get a safe as well. So I think we will get a safe. I have a lot of plans for this office. So don't worry. This is going to look really... This is going to be the ultimate office. I'm serious. Oh, look at that. Oh, you could put stuff in there. Can you... Oh, you can't actually put stuff in there. Wait a second. Maybe that's why they invented it. Can you do this? No, you can't put it in there. It's all for show, man. That's where I put all my money. Don't come rob my place, all right? Oh, what the heck? Get out of here. There we go. All right, it's getting a little bit crowded, so we got to be careful here. I think, though, we should go with uh, home. Ooh. Ooh, hold up, hold up. Electronics here. Um... How much bigger? This monitor is way too huge to put in here. But I think that we should go with a... Hear me out. I think that we should have a hanging TV up here. What do you think? So that we can like have like live stream chat going. It looks a little slanted to me. Am I crazy? You can't perfect. That's that's horrible for OCD. Oh my. Oh. Oh, you just have to put it, pick it up, and put it back down. Honestly, you know what'd be cool if we just had that screen there. That would be pretty sweet. Should we have both or just the TV? Let me know in chat what you think. We could even, if we wanted to, have. It doesn't, it doesn't look good if you put them sideways, but if it did look good, we could do that. Let's put this up here. I wish you could turn on this monitor, because it kind of looks weird when it's just off. Oh, 
A lot of people are saying both. I think both does look good. Let's go ahead and push this a little bit further back. Just move a one over to the left so it's all even. There we go. There we go. There we go. And I think we're gonna make this one a little bit more. What is what does the plaster do? I really want to know what like. I know what plaster is, but what does it do in this game? Yeah, a lot of you guys saying both. You're getting ahead of yourself, bro. We go. We wildin' out, dog. We wildin' out, dog. Uh, let's go over here and go with... Uh, not ceiling lamp. Oh, I feel like the reflector... This would look cool in the office. <gasps> Dude, that looks so sweet. Okay, let's, let's sell this light. Honestly, the light... Oh, that's awesome. Oh, I'm so glad we got this. Okay, maybe we should spin it the other way. Oh, that looks great. I think that looks so much better. How about the ceiling lamp line? I'm curious how that would look, though. Let, let's see. Let's move this. Move this into the corner. Honestly, that looks pretty sweet. Let me keep let me look keep looking through these options though, because we got quite a few cool options we can get. Um whatever these are pronounced, because I keep pronouncing them wrong. And I apologize. What's that hanging shelf? Hanging shelf does look cool. I wish I had something instead like live or something. That would be pretty sweet. I think a fluorescent light here would look cool. Look at that. Look at that. How about if you did two of them and then you flipped one? Hi, Samara. How are you? Good. Hello. <laughs> Good. Hello. I don't know if I like that light there. Which one do you like better? I think those sell this one. Sell that one. I think we'll probably put this here. Again, let me know your thoughts. I really appreciate everybody's comments. And thoughts on where to put stuff and why to put stuff where I put them. Custom poster, curtains. Double monitor. I want to do double monitor. We can try. Okay, I'm going to try because a lot of you guys are requesting that double monitor look. I just don't know if we could fit it. But I'm going to try, okay? It's it's too tough of a fit, man, I think. What do you guys think? Should we double monitor or no? Just give me a yes or no in chat. I think we can probably make it work. I think it'll look a little bit weird if I do double monitors. Maybe if we spun it a little bit more. It's just, it takes up so much desk space, unfortunately. I mean, that doesn't look bad. That looks pretty sweet. A lot of you guys saying yes. If I can just force this onto the desk still, that would be great. 
I feel like this one's just way far off the, the desk. Are they at the same? They're not at the same angle, though. See, this one's like one back. There we go. Now they're at the same angle. All right, man. We can roll double monitor. I think that looks pretty sweet. And then let's go. I'm just going to turn on the AC in my actual place because I am really, really hot at the moment. We can just go ahead and do that. I think we might change the floor as well. Should I go back to carpet? What do you guys think? We don't need a sleeping quarters here in the office. I'm going to go ahead and go with a no for the sleeping quarters. I think that looks good there. Should we get speakers? Loudspeaker mountain. Oh, wow. That's huge. It's a little bit too much. Hanging speakers? Oh, can you do that? Oh, that one can't hang. Um... Loudspeaker standard. This one can't hang either. This one's quite huge, actually. Um, we can only really have the speakers that are kind of sideways like this. Yeah, there's no floating speakers. There's no floating speakers. We need to have our custom art here to do these do these drawings as well. We should Oh. I swear some of this stuff wasn't here before. This stuff looks beautiful. Wow. Wow. Like I jive with this thing. Bro, I'll have a picture of a rock on a wall. Picture of the rock on the wall. Like I would love to have um Speakers hanging left and right there. I think that would look pretty cool. Plasters for the ceiling. Oh, interesting. Okay. So. I think this looks pretty sweet so far. We got the mouse and keyboard here. I kind of want to put one monitor. You should put the speaker on the window ledge. I should put the DVD player. We're going to pretend that this DVD player is a console, okay? There we go. So we got the Xbox hooked up over there. Moose should have another Xbox and PlayStation. But they, they look exactly the same, so... In this game. So... Don't think that works, man. Don't think that works. We could put the speaker on the wall here if we wanted to. Oh, and we could have a curtain if you guys like. Curtains and blinds, curtains and blinds. E no we can't. Never mind. It doesn't fit. Does not fit. We let's just assemble this though, because we forgot to. Forgot to re put it in there. There we go, that looks good. Alright, so we got that. We got our speaker over there. You know what? I think the speaker should go... Yeah, maybe a plant on the windowsill would be better. I actually don't know if I like the blinds there. I'm going to be real with you. I'm going to be real with you on that one. Uh, What else do we need? Okay, we're going to do our small little kitchen here as well. I feel like our floor is way too dark. Would that look better? I think that actually looks better. I think that looks a lot better. Um, 
Man, it's so it's so hard to choose. Let me just say that because with everybody watching too, like everybody wants a different thing, so you never know. You're never gonna please everybody, right? How about that one in the corner? That one definitely does not work. All right, last attempt here is gonna be oh, how about a blue carpet? Second last attempt. All blue, everything probably looks really ugly. The blue carpet actually works a little bit, but we're not going to go with that. Let's go ahead try the last thing here, which is the beige carpet. Honestly, the beige carpet kind of works. Thoughts? Thoughts on the beige carpet? It's got that office feel to it for sure. Sliding door for the office. There's not a lot of room in here, so... Don't know if a sliding room for the office is going to be the best option here. Um, what I am going to do is, since I really like this poster, we're going to go ahead and put it up behind here. And I think to put it up behind here, uh, we should go with a nice light there as well. I think the sconce... The sconces would be nice. And do we like the hanging shelf? No, no, we didn't like the hanging shelf. That looked like a bathroom. The fluorescent light was nice, but that's too big there. Let's go with a small fluorescent light. I think over the poster, that would look nice. All right, let's turn on the light. Good work takes hard work. I actually don't think we need a light. Good work takes hard work. There we go. We gotta, we gotta stay motivated on the job. You know what we're missing? We're missing one thing over here. We're missing a picture of Miku on the desk. I think that's very important. We're missing a picture of Miku on the desk. And we're missing a clock as well. We gotta know what time it is. You should have it like those, you know, you know those like fancy places that have like the five clocks and they're all different time zones. We should have that. Check out the bathroom floor. What am I looking for? It didn't go into the bathroom floor. If it did, you won't see it because of the door frame. So it's all good. It's all good. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. Okay. What to do next here? Oh, we need a picture of Miku. I almost forgot. Oh, let's put a welcome mat too. Gotta make sure these people that come into the house aren't dirty, you know? There we go. Oh, oh, okay. All right, that's what you guys are talking about. All right, don't, don't, don't kill me. I'm sorry. I'll fix it, man. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. It's fixed. It's fixed. Okay, so we got all this done over here. I still have a feeling that it would look cool if I did the 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 floor the big fluorescent light over the TV. Is that too much? Is that overkill? Let me know your thoughts. Is that overkill or not? I feel like it might be overkill. So we probably won't do that. Okay, let's quickly... So we're going to make like a kitchen area over here, I think. Just so that we can like grab a bite to eat or work on the fly. Again, this is a small office. This isn't going to be our dedicated office for the whole time. So we just got to have a few things. Like, I would love to have this corner hex thing. Ooh. But the problem is it's so massive. So bloody massive. This would be nice in a really nice modern house. Um, ooh, modern hanging cupboard would be so nice as well. Oh, that would be really cool. Honestly? That would be kind of cool above, like, the desk, but it wouldn't really work. This would be really cool, like, hanging off the ceiling, too. You know what I mean? Like, if it was, like, up here to make it look like kitchen vibes. 
Um, but we also have kitchen set with oven hacks. Blah, 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 blah. Bro, we don't need to make... We're not looking to bake a pizza here, dog. Wait, is there cupboards? Oh, cupboards. <gasps> Wait, why didn't I get these before? I've totally forgot there's bookcases and stuff, man. Office bookshelf. What? Oh, we'll probably have to put one of these, like, over here. At the front. I think that would be a good idea. Stupid chainsaw. Move chainsaw. How do you reach that, though? You're not a foot tall brick? Come on. <laughs> Come on, dude. You gotta be at least 20 foot tall to play this game. Um, There's some nice ones here. Shoe cabinet with tree hanger. Ooh. Oh, that's really classy. If, if at all, I would use colors like that. Some of these are really sweet. I don't think I've ever clicked on this category, so this is all new to me, man. Yes, I need to put the Miku picture. Don't worry. It will go down. Uh, details, gray. Colors, white. Oh, that does that one. Burned Beach. Maroki. Wood Cherry. Marble. White. Black. Marble. Might be worth it to put something like that in the corner. Bookshelves with pictures. Yeah, a bookshelf might be good. For sure. Let's get Miku's picture up, though. We gotta make sure. I gotta actually, like, go in the files and replace it with Miku. But for now, it'll work. For now, it'll work for what I want, okay? Uh, where is it under? Is it under pictures and painting? Oh, it is. Okay. I'm gonna picture my cat. <laughs> it's not my cat, but... Honestly, close enough, okay? Close enough. We should just have it beside the laptop. Oh my God. <laughs> Would that look good? <laughs> look at this. <laughs> oh, wait, wait, we gotta put it like right there. Hold up. If we put it right here, we might be able to see it as we go on the computer. That would be the best thing ever in this game. <laughs> That's too funny. Why is that so funny? <laughs> oh man. Okay. So let's get back to the kitchen here. Let's get back to the kitchen. We gotta get back to the kitchen. Oh, we got plants here. Ooh. Got some nice plant options. I feel like as soon as you walk in, we gotta make it aesthetic, you know? Aesthetically pleasing. Something like that. There's, there's gonna be a plant of some sorts in that corner. I'm not, I haven't decided completely where, what, but maybe it'll be this plant. Who knows? You know what? Some One of you had a really great idea. There we go. We should make a shrine to Miku. We should have like candles there. Is there a Miku shrine? To the most precious feline of all time. Nobody tell Samara I made a Miku shrine, okay? Kind of looks like... <laughs> anyway. Use plaster for the ceiling. Okay, wait, hold up. I want to see what you're talking about. What does it say? Switch the... Pla oh, switch the plastering. Oh, you can plaster holes. That's what it's for. It's not for the ceiling. Yep. 
Okay, so we need a... Is there a mini fridge? That's a good... That would be a good option. It does kind of look like Rip Cat. We're... <laughs> I want a shrine of the cat, but that looks a little weird, so we're going to take it out. We were trying to praise Miku, okay? We were just trying to praise Miku. I feel like we got to put, like... No, I feel like something... So big. Okay, we're we're gonna we're gonna fix that up. But let's go to kitchen real quick. Kitchen and I think everything's a bit too big for this sort of section. Yeah, all this stuff's too big, so we gotta make custom make our own, I think. That would be the best option. We just need something small. We're not looking for something crazy big or anything. We don't need an oven. We just need a microwave and stuff. I love the kitchen set with Andy, but again, uh I don't think we will be needing that at the current moment. This thing looks odd. What the heck? How do you get into that cabinet? Alright, we're going to make this really simple. Let's just do... I feel like this is... This hits a bit too close to home here. I don't think it needs to be that close. What do you guys think? Like, I don't think the sink should be right there. So what we're going to do is corner kitchen cabinet, color, cream, or orange. What the hell? All white. So it has white and a black top. All white might look good. You can make a really interesting house design. So you choose all white, but the size black still. Yeah, kitchens are under, or the fridge and stuff is under. So we'll, we'll go with that in a sec, but let's go back to the kitchen. We'll go back with this uh, corner kitchen cabinet. Kitchen cabinet with drawer. Okay, let's do this one. Just do white on white or whatever. There we go. That's against the wall. Then we're going to need a sink. Color white and gray. Oh, interesting. Yeah. Okay. We're just going to keep it white and gray, I guess. Why isn't it letting me put it, like, here? Bro, let me just put it where it's supposed to be. Why are you having such difficulty, game? Just put it... Oh, there we go. Why is it sideways? What did I do on this planet to deserve this OCD right here? Why can't I connect the cabinet to it? Let me live, bro! Oh, there we go. Okay. Mini fridge by desk. I don't think there is a mini fridge. FYI. Yeah, for some reason it's not letting me put it like that. So I'm going to have to put it beside it. There we go. Why is... Why is it... Uh, why is it doing this that's so weird it's like all slightly it's like all slightly off this wall is just like uneven I think it must be Breathe, CG, breathe. Okay, I think that's as even as we're going to get it. I'm about to lose. I'm about to flip it, bro. Like, are you bloody serious? Why is it sticking out like that? Uh... <laughs> I think the wall's crooked. I'll be real with you guys. I think the wall's crooked. Uh, 
Alright, screw it. We're getting a fridge. Fridge. What, what is fridge under? It's under home appliances. Refrigerator is the word they're looking for here. Let's just get a refrigerator stack, I guess. Refrigerator Japan? What the heck? That's so random. Alright, let's just get a refrigerator stack. And then what else do we really need? We need a stack, we need a microwave, right? So like we can go to kitchen for that. And then is there a small little... Wait, honestly, we should have might as well just put this thing. We just need like the smallest... Kitchen island thing. Well, this thing would have been good. Oh, what is this? Oh, that looks really sweet. But where would we put the fridge? We could just do a kitchen table. Should we just do a table? We can do a table, push it against the wall, call it a day. I mean, it's an office. It's not a buffet. I don't know. I just wanted to look good. What is everybody thinking of the office so far? Put the refrigerator in the corner, and then we can move this here. Ah, uh, man. This is getting tough. This is getting tough. I have that from Ikea. No kitchen without a sink. What to do, what to do, what to do. Let's go with... Again, we could do this. The problem is that wall's so slanted. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. I think the office is looking great too. I'm trying to think here. I think the office looks great too. I think my only beef is with the kitchen, but I we can we can fix it, you know. Let me just see something here. Um, uh, put an L in her office. L. Why is everything not the right way? We should put this here and then just put magazines on it. That'd be pretty cool, right? We need a poof. <laughs> a rug and some art done. Hanging shelf with for microwave? That's not a bad idea. I mean, we could put the microwave... I don't know if the microwave would fit on this, actually. The table is looking good. Alright, you know what? Let's go ahead and get the table here. The table's coming back, boys. We can do a round table. You 
Yeah, I don't think we need two sinks either. You guys are right. This coffee table looks dope for like a place for... You take forever? I care about my things, man. I care about them, okay? Oh, that that's a better table, I think. It looks way less flimsy. Let's put that there. So then what we're going to need is... Because we could get like... Oh, we can get a nut on top. Or we get a wood cherry, venge. That would look pretty cool with the rest of the design. What do you guys think? With the venge? We can match the motif, but I kind of want people to know this is the kitchen, right? Something that stylizes that lets people know. So let's put a coffee maker on here. And let's put a... What else do we need? A microwave oven on here too. Perfect. Okay. Let's do that. We could even spin it a little bit if we wanted to. Put the microwave like over here. Have a nice look to it. Have a pool table. That's random for an office. Of this size, it's super random. Can you buy like plates and stuff? Or like a cup? Plate. Plate. Cup. Cup. I wish you could put like... Like that stuff that's in the houses, you can't, you can't put that otherwise, unfortunately. Let's just go to other real quick. One second here. You could put a fork. You could put a cutting board. Um, put a knife. Knife stand if we wanted to. A teapot. Put a hanging shelf here. The office look is great. Well, I'm glad you're enjoying it, man. Thanks for the compliment. A sofa? I think a sofa there would look pretty nice. I know I had a cup and I sold it, man. It's okay. Dish is not a thing either. Unfortunately, they don't want you to have dishes out here, man. Cabinet with hanging shelves. Ooh. Ooh. That would look cool if ah uh, man, that would look cool if we could add more things to it. But just like that, I don't, th I don't think it's, I don't think it's got that thing on it. You know what I'm saying? Put fork knife on it. Buy a safe for the office. We already got one, bro. Don't worry, I got you. Um, is there anything else that would go well with it? <laughs> Put a sledgehammer on it. A mug? Can you get a mug? Mug. No. We can do pictures and paintings still. So that's that's totally an option. We should do something nice and serene to look at while you go and microwave your burrito. Like a photo view from the mountains. We should have a motivational wall of posters. Oh. <gasps> there we go. Get that office look right there. Work means victory. Yas. Utensils? Utensils. No. <laughs> yeah, the hanging shelf upside down doesn't make any sense. We can... Oh! Oh! <gasps> yes! Survival! Thank you whoever said this. Um, survival has a few things. Pickled cucumbers, jar of soup, macaroni, peanut, peanut butter. A jar of peanut butter right there. Can we put it on top of the microwave? No. Okay, jar of peanut butter for sure. We can get some rice if we need. Can of chickpeas. A spoon. A spoon. Excuse me. We have a spoon. We 
We could have a uh, water container here. That might be good under the desk or something. Uh, organic food. Now this is Samara's office, very clearly. We gotta have stuff to heat up, you know? Canned meat, meatballs, chickpeas. Let's do some canned meatballs in case the, we want we get hungry. Can of chickpeas too, why not? Throw that in there. Actually, we'll keep those there. So that'll go there. Peanut butter goes there too. Oh, there we go. This is starting to look real nice. Starting to look very nice, very nice. I think I care way too much about how this office is looking right now. All right, there's that coffee machine. We're going to push back a little bit. Can you keep that in the fridge? You can actually open the fridge, so there's that. And I do like the spoon, but I feel like we might have to throw that spoon away. Might have to throw the spoon away. Where would the rice go? Oh, just a package of rice. Just some rice. Just some rice, man. I know the microwave's tilted. I tilted it, bro. We're gonna sell the spoon. The spoon is sold. All right, there we go. So that that little set setup is done there. I still think a sconce would be pretty cool. <laughs> really lightens up the office. Put the canned food on a shelf. Ooh. Might not be a bad idea. What do you guys think? Should I put a shelf? That's under other, right? We should we should have a knife stand. In case we need to cut our sandwich in half or something, you know? Look for a bowl. Bowl. Nada. Alright, let's get the shelf. A lot of you guys are suggesting that and I think that's a good idea. So, hanging shelf down. Bro, I swear the shelf is the same thing no matter what. Like, does it really matter? Does it? You are kidding me. You can't put anything on the shelf. <laughs> What's the point? All right, no shelf it is. Okay, so we got all that there. Let's get a water for underneath as well. We can have nuts and stuff. Ooh, nuts might be good to have. Healthy snack under 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 the desk or something. Get a potion shelf. First aid kit might be good to have. Just in case anyone gets hurt. Seeing as I'm the only one in the office in case I get hurt. Plastic barrel looks like we're in breaking bad or something. We'll get a water container under here in case somebody wants water. Is it because it's upside down? Oh, this shelf is going to be the end of my life, bro. Hanging shelf up. Okay. Can we put stuff on it now? Oh, we can. Very interesting. All right, perfect. Thank you, guys. I think some of you were right before too, saying that uh, the poster might. The nut jar does not come in nut, unfortunately. Peanut butter. Nutter peanut butter. We have all different types of options for food up here. 
We take pride here at uh, typical renovations. What other options can we have here? Uh, can of tomatoes. All right, a little bit weird to have in an office. Tomato soup, though. It's tomato soup. Don't worry. It's not weird because it's tomato soup. Can of tuna. And then, as you know, here we're we're big fans of uh, nut butter. So let's go put another nut up there. There we go. <laughs> and then with this, we can we can go ahead and move this a little bit closer. And maybe in case people want water, right? Water might be a good option to just have on deck. A couple water bottles. It's, it's good to hydrate. It's good to stay hydrated. Got to keep the crew. Whoever works for me is going to be hydrated to the nines. There we go. I think that looks pretty good. I don't know how good this poster looks here, but... Maybe we'll remove this light. And then we'll move the poster. There we go, there we go. Not bad, not bad. What do you guys think so far? What do you guys think so far? Let me know. Oh, we should get the knife stand, yep. Totally forgot about that, actually. Maybe we should sell the water then. And then let's get the knife stand. Um... There we go. Okay. I think that's great. We got the nice office vibes there. We can keep the chainsaw under the desk if we wanted to. Keep the chainsaw under the desk. I really don't know what this thing is. I just want to throw that out there. It's like a tin of something. It's a tin of something and I just don't know what it is. I'll read Super Chats in just a bit, by the way. Remove that light, too. Okay. What else do we need? You put it backwards, the shelf? Oh, no. Oh, that's the way it should be, huh? <laughs> oh. Can I, like, move it at all now? Is everything gonna float? Oh. I just love my life right now. Alright, come on, guys. We gotta put you back on the shelf. One meatball at a time. Come on, meatball. Organic food here. Tomato soup. Tomatoes soup, actually. You're welcome. Can of tuna here. And we got the, the nut butter again. Let's bring this one up to the forefront a little bit more. There we go. All right. Let's do it. It's looking good. I think that we just need a carpet here. Um, do, 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 do. Not cupboards. Honestly, though. That probably would have been nicer for instead of a table. I like, I like the office vibe, though. I like the office vibe. Not changing nothing. The bookcase, though. Should I put a bookcase here? I feel like... Put a couch? Like, couches would be very squished in here. This isn't... There isn't a lot of space here. You know what I mean? Not a lot of space, man. There's not a lot of space at all, to be truthful. Like, where am I supposed to put a couch? There's no gaming chairs as well. 
I, I love the creativity some of you are bringing, though. I love the creativity. I'm really curious, though. If you put package of panels of... Oh, dude. Why didn't I think of this? Give me a second here. That looks pretty sick. Just like one of the walls brick on the inside. Like if I was live streaming that brick background. And then the rest of it should be blue I think probably. Or gray. I think gray would really lighten up the office more. We need a poof. Y'all like the poofs a little too much man. Y'all like the poofs a little bit too much. Let me tell you that. Uh, faster mountain, faster plastering. Faster mountain there. Um, let's do a poof. Poof. What the heck are the poofs, man? Are they under other poof? I just want to know where the poof is. I just want to know what the truth is. We got a ball. That's dope. That looks really sweet. I love that look. How the hell do you spell poof, man? Poof. There's nothing under P. All. Poof. There we go. Why did that take so long to get? Okay, we need a clock still. We do need, still need a clock. We got a poof. Um... Honestly, it's probably the best color poof in the business. I feel like a plant here would really liven up and separate the kitchen. Or, or, or we could build a wall. No, that would look, that would be way too cramped. Get a camera to record you. Have a conference table for clients. You're wild to now now, dude. Maybe we should have a fan here. Should we have a fan? I think we're getting a little bit too crazy. We're getting a little bit too crazy. That's a beanbag. It's kind of like a beanbag chair. Then we needed a clock. Okay, we're just buying everything now at the moment. We're just going a little bit crazy here. We should do that thing where there's like three clocks going down the wall. Like this. You guys ready for this? This is how you know you're at a fancy office. Maybe just two. It's getting a little cluttered now. It's getting a little cluttered. I'm not a fan of the cluttered. We got that thing on me. You know what I'm saying? Okay, we need another light here too. That actually looks pretty good. We should have the work victory thing and then a couple of nice pictures beside it. You know what I'm saying? Alright, this office is looking sweet. Can we be real with each other? This office is looking dope. Though I think I'll make one change here. The speakers are going to be right underneath here. So we can hear it loud and clear. And then this folder... Which is allegedly supposed to be recipes. Yeah, right. 
It's going to be right over there. Oh, we should have a um, desk lamps. I forgot there's all these lamps. This desk lamp is legit. It doesn't shine much light though. Does it? I feel like we need one in this corner though. I do like this look too. Ooh, I like that. Little 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 vibes there, you know what I'm saying? I like the little vibes it'd be given. You need the flex light as well. Okay. So we got we got a lot going on here. I'm gonna move these two computers because I think this one looks cooler. This one's gonna go in the shadows a bit. We're gonna do the outside part too, don't worry. Then let's go ahead and do carpet. Is this one I wanna do? I think that adds to it. I think that adds to the kitchen a lot, this like carpet area. Um, whoa, what is this? Cornflowers, grassy green, beige stripes, lily, blue, stripes. Like, I'm actually a big fan of these sort of the multicolor ones. I think they look really cool. You can have some really ugly carpets, though. I'm going to be honest with you. Why is there such ugly colors? Why can't we just have a nice carpet? Just a nice normal carpet, man. Why you gotta do it like that? Why you gotta do it like that, man? That's way too big there. I don't think there's trash cans. I don't think there's security cameras either. I think cream looks great great here. We're gonna go ahead and buy this. It's not really a kitchen. That's true. Now I don't know if I like it anymore. What is this game done to me? Oh that actually looks cool. Thoughts on that? We can carpet that area. We can tile that area and then leave carpet in the rest. Alright, hear me out. La last thing. Last thing I'm going to do before I do the outside, I think, personally. How about if we did? Hear me out before y'all go crazy, okay? How about if I did? Floor panel brown here. Up until here, okay? Hear me out, hear me out. Don't call me crazy yet. And then we went with... Um, wait, what? Wasn't there an easier way to do that? Oh, it wasn't wall panels. Floor tiles, there we go. Don't call me crazy yet. Like, do you guys think that looks good? Because I think that looks pretty sweet. We could even push it to, like, we could even push it to this line so that it's even. <laughs> oh no, I'm going crazy. Oh, I'm sorry. I don't think that's a bad idea. We should also like. Let me try one more thing here too. I think that looks pretty good. I don't know. Okay, I haven't decided on that yet. Let's go ahead and do the outside. 
before I forget, and then we have an ugly outside of the house. Let's go ahead and turn on our flashlight here. So let's do all suggestions you guys have. Let me know in chat. If you're watching and enjoying this, by the way, make sure to hit that like button. If you're new around here, hit that subscribe button. And I'll read Super Chats in just a bit. Thank you all for the incredible support. For real. Let's go ahead and put these wall panels on. Package of tiles would be useful. I got you a package, son. I have like infinite ones apparently this time. Oh, there we go. Ooh, looking fancy. Honestly, a brick house might look better. 27% sane. Hey, you can't bring a forest in here, man. Yeah, the outside bricks might look good, for real. But you know what? Let's just finish up with this. I was gonna take way too much time. This back part is easy. This back part is really easy. We're just gonna we're just gonna slay it real quick. It's going to take me an hour to do all bricks if you guys wanted me to change it up. F to the Y to the I. Let's purchase another one of these. Let's purchase another one of these. Let's purchase another one of these over here. That way we'll never have to take them out again, probably. Put these all down. Yeah, the only part annoying part about doing the outside is doing the little ledges. I have the flashlight because I can't see otherwise. Oh, I thought I... Oh, I think I just used it by accident on another piece. We're going double time right here. And work it over time. Work out. There we go. Ooh, what the heck? Oh. Oh, is that still going to leave that top part there? I can't change that top part. That's annoying. To my knowledge, I can't change that. Ah, put it on. There we go. Get one. There's only like seven left. Oh, I put it on another one. Brick instead of the gray paint look. Might have a point. There we go. I think we just did it. Yeah, it doesn't seem like you can put it on there. Alright, that is all good. Back to the interior here. Actually, it looks really nice. The interior, I'm not going to lie. It does look really cool. I love that, that brick look there. Should we do brick instead of gray? Or should we keep the gray? Because the gray actually does look pretty decent. Yeah, I'm a hard worker. I do have a headlamp on. The bathroom's good. We gotta fix this whole bathroom situation though after. Let me, let's just do real quick. Um, we gotta go put a ceiling lamp. Let's just put one in. I think the halogen lamp would be good in here. Made two of them. Oh, that looks really nice. Really light up your bathroom experience. Light up those bathroom experience. <laughs> Brick is always a good choice. I see you. I see you, bro. <laughs> A lot of people saying gray still. All 
All right, I think this office looks really, really great so far. I think we just need like one or two more things and it'll be perfect. I'm curious if we put two pot lights over. Oh, that really lightens it up. Oh, that is sweet. Maybe we should buy more over here too. I love me some light. You guys know that. That looks fantastic. I think that looks great. What do you guys think? Look, lights off. Lights off. It's like, oh, that's cool. It's an office. Lights on. Boom. Look at that. I'm curious. I'm not going to put the third one here, probably. Let me just take that one away. That looks so good. Shelf for the tools. I think we do got to do that. Shelf for the tools would be a good idea. Um, what else are we missing, though? You need an oven? We don't need an oven. Don't worry about that. What's up with the chainsaw, bro? Sometimes you need a chainsaw, okay? Let's not ask too many questions, okay? Let's not ask too many questions. I think the cupboard is is what we probably need to put in here. I think like a steel shelving unit would be awesome. But that would be kind of cool to split off the areas, but nah. But nah. I think we got to move this puff. Sometimes you got to sit by the puff by the radiator. Or you got to eat with the puff there. I think this looks too industrial for the office. It does look a bit too industrial. Would like the bookcase look good at the front? I feel like we need something at the front. What do you guys think? The knife stand is backwards. You know what, man? I've never had a knife stand, okay? I'm not that fancy, bro. You people in your fancy knife stands. There you go. It is an office, not a bedroom, by the way. There's no bed. I'm not putting a bed. Oh, CD overload. Make a vending machine. <laughs> Client's waiting area. Me like a... That's too big. Why is this radiator gotta be here? Why do I even need a radiator? To stay warm or something? Build a shed? Remove this just a little bit. Or we can remove it completely if we wanted to. The microwave is the wrong way. The microwave is the right way, bro. Don't worry about the microwave. We can't add a shed or anything. That's not possible at the moment. We can add, like, a wall here if we wanted to. A chairs and a table. The lights under the monitor. You know what? I'm going to entertain that idea right here real quick. Let me just check a sconce. And if we put a fluorescent light. It's going to be impossible to sell, though. Oh, no. Oh, I can't believe I actually got that. Whew. We already have speakers. I'm just thinking what to do with this last section here. All right, last thing we're going to try. Real, real quick. No sofa will work here. So let's just go ahead and should we just keep this here? And then this will be it. This is where we'll have our office meeting. We'll have two, we'll have two puffs. I think two puffs is, might be the ultimate. Two poofs might be the ultimate um, 
meeting spot here. We're going to have two poofs for our clients. But we need a bookcase, man. We need a bookcase. All right. Bookshelf, that's it. These cons these little puffs can go like over here or something. Kind of get in the way, but coffee table with magazines. There's a small sofa option. Oh boy. How have I been doing this for two hours? What? Goodness. I'm not putting a bed. No point in asking for a bed. It's not happening. Why are these going to be so ugly, these? Alright. Bookshelf it is. Cupboard. Uh, bookcase. Let's do this one. I think. Let me just see the other ones. Office bookcase. It's quite large, but does it cover the door? If it does, I do not want it. Fortunately, it will cover the door a little bit. Otherwise, I would choose it. The chest of drawers looks really, really sweet. We could do a chair and a table, and then we could put all our tools on this little table. Put a shelf on top of the bathroom door. Okay, hold up. Maybe we can move some of this stuff. Like, okay, let, let's see if we can repurpose this. Like, the hatchet, I don't think we should put on our desk. But maybe we could store it near Miku. You know what I mean? It would be nice if we could put anything in the safe, but we can't do that. So there's that. Doesn't seem like we can put that there either. This thing looks like it can be a... No, it doesn't really go anywhere either. The screwdriver we can keep on our desk. Screwdriver and pliers. I mean, we are a handyman. It's not that weird. There we go. We got we got to keep some handyman things near us. You don't need it, but I want it. Can I put the sledgehammer down here? Let me store the sledgehammer somewhere, man. Leave it under our desk. <laughs> Hide the tools out back. You can't actually leave anything outside, I don't think. No, you can't leave anything outside. You can't make a shed. Sell the tools you don't want. Okay, I'm going to sell this one then. That one's ugly. And the rest of the ones I want to keep. Like, I like the sledgehammer and stuff. But I think that we should have, like, a little bit of a... We could add, like, a venge here. Right to the corner or something. And then we could add, like, we could put the sledgehammer on top of it. And the rest of these tools that we like. I don't know if this one's going to fit. Maybe we'll sell this one. They're going to be like, sir, you are a handyman, right? Like, yeah, man, I do lots of handy stuff. Just don't get too close to those cool tools, all right? Sledgehammer's so big. Can't put anything down. Put the tools in a box? You can't, to my knowledge, put the tools in a box. Under the sink? 
See, I wish you could. I just don't know. It doesn't let me do it. It doesn't let me put it on top of things that aren't aren't allowed to. We're gonna put the wrench in the bathroom. We're gonna put the wrench here. We're gonna put a toilet roll. In case we need it, you know. When duty calls. Literally. I wish I could make a nice little toilet roll stack. No, I'll do my best. The OCD has come. It has conquered in the stream, ladies and gentlemen. Why can't I put it there? Oh, that's even worse for me, man. No, that's fine there. Maybe we'll put this back there, too. Don't think that's gonna fit. So can I not line them up here? Oh, I can. I'm just gonna line up the toilet rolls. Put it outside. You can't put it outside. The dirty wrench, man. Don't know many wrenches that are super clean, though, so there's that. Just sell them. I want to keep them because if you can't get them from... Can't get them, and they look pretty cool, so... Wait, how do you scroll quickly again? It's shift... Oh, there we go. Alright, they totally won't think I'm up to anything weird with that in my office. Okay, that's normal. put all this effort to try to get this hacksaw to fit window sill by the door oh you legend you saved my life actually you know what I'm gonna put the sledgehammer there there we go good old classic sledgehammer and then finally where's the chairs at I was thinking we get a super, super cool chair. Like one of these. Or we could just leave the poofs. Maybe we just keep the poofs. Maybe we'll put one of these chair. Sit down, sir. Welcome to my office. Be like, are you sure you're licensed to do any of this? Be like, yes, I'm very licensed. I'm the most licensed, actually. That's the poof in the corner. All right, I think we're pretty much done our office. I feel like though, sell this door, close this door. Let's go ahead and buy a door. How many times can I say the word door is the real question. Door, 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 whore door, a whore door, door. That's the wrong, that's the wrong number. Why are you the wrong way? Why are you the way you are, door? Okay, please, somebody on earth tell me, how is it slanted? I'm about to lose it. They may take our freedoms, but they never. We'll take off poof. I agree. Alright, please. Of all things holy. Why won't you go straight? Just please. Just go straight. Alright, that looks way better. I say we make this wall brick too. And complete the look. This is the ultimate office right here. Please buy trophies for the office. I don't think there's any trophies, man. I'm sorry to, sorry to let you know this, but... Trophies. No trophies. Okay. 
I think this place looks great. What do you guys think? What would you rate the office out of 10? Let me know in chat. I think it looks pretty sweet. I mean, this is a huge upgrade from what we had before. Huge upgrade. We can lock the bathroom from inside here. What do you think? What would you rate it out of 10? This isn't a bedroom, so this is an office. I think that this looks fan diddly tastic. I kind of want to put brick on this wall too, though. Let, let's see what it would look like real, real quick. Would it be cool brick vibes or nah? It's an easy fix if we don't like it. Uh. I kind of dig it. I kind of don't. I think we should go back with the gray. Let's go paint it quick, 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 quick. Look how fast we paint. There we go. All right, that's a huge upgrade. Again, if you watched and enjoyed this video, make sure you smack that like button. If you're new around here, hit that subscribe button. And let's do one more job before we wrap this one up. So this is what our office looks like now. And I think it looks pretty freaking sweet. Looking pretty fly, if you ask me. Look at this bathroom. Everything looks, look, looks great. We got our tools over here. We've got our office. This is the ultimate office right here. Look at that. Looking pretty sweet. Plus we got a picture of Miku over here. Coming in, coming in freaking clutch. That's what it's coming in. It's coming in clutch. All right. So let's go ahead and look at this. Look at that. Look how cool that is. I love the setup there. Let's go ahead and go to our office here. And let's go to mail and let's do. Um, which one should we do? Hmm. Let's go with additional walls. So, good afternoon. I need some alterations made to my two-room house. My daughter is now three, and we feel it is time that she has her own room. Please divide the bedroom into two rooms and make sure that the new rooms both have doors that connect to the corridor. Could you please also put a new bed and remove the crib? All right, let's go ahead and do that. Let's do it. Let's do it. Okay, so there's a lot of tasks to do. So we got to go ahead and... What is this over here? Oh, I think we just have to assemble. Is that what we got to do? Can you move out of the way, plant, for a second? Alright, we got to assemble this. Or disassemble and reassemble. Whatever you want to call it, we got to do it. Whatever pays the most. They don't, they don't really say how much they pay, unfortunately, so... Let's go ahead and do some wiring here, some elect electrician stuff. You know, I'm a certified electrician. We'll do a flip in the next episode, I believe. We will do that. Well, I mean, it's up to me. So, yes, we will do that next time. All right, that's good. See, at least these people don't keep their house messy. What the heck? Can I put it back? I really can't put it back. Alright, you know what? I had to move it. Whatever. Oh, what the heck is this? Honestly, this house looks pretty sweet. Is there, I gotta take some... I gotta take some advice from this place, man. Oh, maybe I should put those tiles in my... Anyway. Uh, so we gotta go ahead and... What is this? There's something behind here. You want me to do this one too? I'll assemble this one too. Oh, this is a different one, isn't it? Oh, it is a different one. 
it's a different plug. Oh, okay. Yeah, I knew that. Let's plug that in. Thank you. Plug that in. You're welcome. And put that in there. Perfect. Let's push that back in the wall. Do these little screws up. And put the cover back on. And screw that up too. And then let's move this over here. So what they want is... they want. Oh, okay. So they want me to... There's just like a closet room here. They want me to bring down the walls, baby. You know what we're going to do? Bring down the walls. Wait. Wait. Give it back to me. Give it back to me. <gasps> Yeet. Yeet. Wait. There we go. Let's knock this all the way down, baby. We don't need these walls in our lives no more. Let's break this all down. Everything must go. Everything must go. Let's break it down. Let's break it down. There we go. Oh, we got a new demolition skill. Let's do 25% fat. Uh, let's do professional hammer now. Oh, look at my hammer. Oh, it looks cool. All right, so we got to go ahead and get rid of the crib. And place object. Bed grill. Can I sell your other stuff? So we have to... I'm going to move this real quick. Wow, you guys are really going to have a cramped room. Let me just throw that, throw that out there. I think we got to build a wall here too, so... Uh, I think that's where this is, has to go. There we go. So we have to build all these walls here. I don't know if they want us to paint it or not. We're already done the minimum progress, but every time we do a wall, we spend $14 and make 50 So it just makes sense. Break down the whole house. I don't think I'd be hired again if I did that. I'm going to be real with you. I don't think they would choose me for another job. Come on. Three more walls. Okay, yeah, a door's still there, so we're, we're good on the door front. Alright. Is there a task in this room? I already did that. Is there a task in this room? No tasks. No tasks. No tasks. Wait, was there a task there? Oh, it's just furnish the room. Okay, what we're gonna do is just jam the stuff in the corner. Then we gotta place a bed grille. A bed grille. Uh, bed solid. Oh, there it is, okay. You are going to get your bed. I wouldn't place it here, but because I'm just trying to do a job well done. But there we go. Oh, order is 100% complete. You're freaking welcome. Holy shoot. Oh, there's a basement. What the heck? Harry Potter, where are you? Oh, Harry Potter, where are you? Harry? Harry, I've come. Please, sir, they locked me in the basement. I don't need to paint the wall. That's up to them. They didn't pay me to paint the wall. They're not going to pay me extra to paint the wall. So there's that. Oh, I ran to the basement again. I'm out of here. Let's complete this task. We made $4,207. Boom! Cash money, baby! Cash money. Okay. Should we do one more job? Smash more? Y'all crazy. 
What was that? Oh, did we just get an email or something? Oh, it feels good to get back to our office. I think we did just get another email. Uh, save me from these horrible colors. Bathroom and home workshop. Necessary extra bathroom. Hello, my grandma who lived with us passed away last year. Her room has been standing empty for many months. And together with my husband, we decided to rebuild it. My husband needs a tool room, and I dream of an extra bathroom. Because although our house is small, there is only one bathroom in it. It's not small. Our kids are growing, and mornings can be difficult when you can't use the bathroom because someone is in it. Please remove all of my grandma's items from grandma's room. Build a wall dividing it into two rooms. The existing bathroom is exactly above the grandma's room, so you should be able to mount everything in the new bathroom. I would like this new bathroom to be elegant and functional. Choose bright, tiled, and cover all walls. Should we help out? Let's do it. Let's do it, man. We gotta help them out. They've been through a tough time. Um, okay. Oh, is it downstairs? Is it downstairs? Wait, what? Wait, what? I'm confused. They want this to be a bathroom? Oh, they do want this to be a bathroom. Well, this is odd. Was grandma... The grandma balling at, uh... That's immoral. Why is that immoral and me selling everything else not immoral? I gotta sell all your stuff. I'm sorry. They don't want it anymore. That's immoral. We're not playing Thief Simulator. Oh. So I can sell all this and be Gucci. But I just, I can't sell. I can't sell like two things. I saw like unscrew. Oh, unscrew. There we go. Alright, so we got to build a wall here. So that, we kind of made some money from that, didn't we? They're like, yeah, you can keep whatever you like. Building skill. Um, oh, we never even did anything here. Faster building, the, the built wall is already painted. Oh, that's neat. Oh, no, I probably should have just not done that. Ah, eh, whatever. It's already painted. We good. Alright, so we gotta go ahead and give them a shower and stuff. So let's go ahead and go with... Uh, bathroom. Mountable shower. That is where the shower is supposed to go, right? Oh, I need to unscrew the cap. Come on. Gotta unscrew all these caps. Okay, let's get, like, the toilet done. First, let's get the tiles done. So, let's just go real quick. Um, floor tiles. There we go. It's not my house, so I don't really care. Well, like, I care. I just... You know what? I care enough that this looks freaking ugly, so we're not gonna put that. Put this one. I feel like they would like it. Nah. I'm gonna go with the gray squares. The gray squares is my staple, I'm gonna be honest. There we go. And then let's go ahead and go to... What is this? Oh, all that all that's tiling on the wall. So that would be... Wall tiles. They want it to be bright, right? I feel like they would like this kind of style. Not my favorite, but... Oh. Why is it not available? Well, that's weird. Why does nobody want a tub these days? I don't even know, man. I don't even know what these little symbols on the map mean. I'm going to be honest. Half of them I can't seem to decipher what they mean. I have to unscrew that too. I have to unscrew everything. Bright colors. 
She said bright colors. Okay, I will have to get bright colors then. This this woman's making my life hard. Let me just tell you that. But you know what? She has a job and I need to do it. So you can buy a bathtub mounted here. Oh, there we go. Somebody wants a bathtub finally. All right, first time mounting a bathtub. Let's go. That's a huge bathtub. What have we done? Let's go ahead and attach that. Ooh. Ooh. All right, yeah, I knew that. Ooh, this is getting fancy. Hook that up there. Plug that in there. Plug that into there. Knew that. Let's screw that in. Ooh, nice little cover. Okay, okay. It's a nice bathtub there. And then what's this going to be? A washer mounted here. What? Home appliances. All right, let's assemble it. Have we mounted a washer before? I think we have mounted a washer before. They're like, use whatever money you get from selling her things and then buy a washer. I'd be like, okay. You're not letting me sell this weird cabinet for some reason, but you know what? You do you. You do you. I'll read all the super chats in just a bit. Thank you guys for your patience. Appreciate it. Oh, oh, we gotta plug that in. There we go, twist that in. I love I love these little sequences, I gotta say. They're a lot of fun. There we go. Oh, that's why they wanted to keep it. So what do they want here though? Oh, a sink. They don't want me to sell it, but they want a sink. Do you understand how hard this is for me? A connoisseur. Let's assemble this. I love how you have to open it to assemble. Like, it doesn't tell you that, but the only way to assemble is to open it. Like that. I should get extra points for knowing what to do before I have to do it. Let's get a mirror in here because uh, we already know how these people like their stuff. So mirror time it is. Get that mirror. Put it vertically so you guys can see what you're doing in the morning. There you go. This thing is really in an inconvenient spot, isn't it? We're going to put that right here. We're going to put that right there. Um, so we need to add a... We need to add a shower and then a toilet still. So let's go ahead and get, let's just get a, let's get this one. We've never done this toilet before. I feel like it would be fun or not. It's the exact same as every other toilet I feel. Oh no, that's a little different. And finally we will get the shower. It'd be cool if you can unlock stuff. Like if you, if you mounted like five showers, you get a new shower or something. This is probably the developer's least favorite part of the game. They're like, you know how much effort it takes to do these little sequences where you gotta screw stuff in? Do you understand, TG? I'm like, no. I just want to do more of them. She said bright colors. Alright, we will bright color it up. Don't worry. We will lighten up the mood here. She will be very pleased with the end product here. Sell everything in the house? I don't think it works like that. Imagine you could. Everything is now mine. I'm sorry, lady. It wasn't supposed to go like this, but this is now a robbery. Oh, I can't even see. There we go. Put that on there. This part confuses me. What am I doing? What am I doing? My favorite part is that you have to do four of these. She did not say bright colors? I'm pretty sure she did. Alright, so that's all done. 
Place object carpet round. So let's go do carpet round. I feel like she would like this stuff. I don't know why. Wait. It just says carpet round. Are you bloody kidding me? It didn't count. Carpet round. Oh, it has to be this one specifically, huh? You're going to do me like that, huh? And then toilet paper holder. You see? They're sketchy. There we go. Okay. So now we can go ahead and sell this thing. Let's go ahead and move this thing so it's just under the shower. There we go. And then, uh, what's the other task? Says so there's one more task. Furnish rooms. So this one? How do I... I don't think this is... I mean, this is a nice room, honestly. I like it. Is it this one? No tasks here. No tasks here. Can I steal some of this? Okay, never mind. We're not going to steal. But if we could. No tasks in here. No tasks in here. No tasks in here. The rug looks like a cookie. Maybe a little bit. All right, where the heck is the last task? Anybody know? How do I get into that room now? Probably in this room. Remove object picture. Oh. Place object chair Alan. Chair Alan. Place object garage shelf. Garage shelf. Wait, wait, garage shelf. Oh, it's the metal one, isn't it? Oh no, I think it's just another garage shelf. And then a standard desk. Standard, stand, dirt, desk. Oh, we, we did it literally 100%. That was easy. Should we even modify to anything else if we don't need to? I feel like we gotta make it look nice at least. He's gonna come back, he's like, what the heck did you guys do? There we go. Honestly, it's nice, man. Hope you enjoy it. I'm gonna help you out though. I'm gonna add a little pain here just because I'm a nice guy. Don't mention it. But uh, next time you need anything to do with uh, painting your house or anything, you know what to call Ghostbusters, all right? Okay. Oh, oh, that's the wrong color. That's the wrong color. Um, this is awkward. I hope it's white. Oh, goodness. What am I doing? Oh, no. What color is it? Guys? I'm typing in random things. I thought I was being nice. Is it faded lemon? It might be faded lemon. Sell the cars and run. This is what... It's definitely not faded lemon. I think it might be just a little coat of this gray. It's really not. What color is that wall? Help! I've messed it up! It's definitely not blue. I already chose gray. Um. It's a lighter gray. I don't think we can... You know what, dude? This side of your house is going to be one different color, okay? You're just going to have to live with it. Life's hard sometimes. 
fog gray. Is there a moody fog? I don't think that's it. I'm gonna try. I really don't think that's it. I think we're gonna make things worse. They're gonna be so mad at me. Oh no. Oh, that's definitely not it. That is de- We're selling that. We're selling that. We'll leave him that one. We'll leave him gray and we'll leave him white. And he can sort it out himself. Um, see ya! Oh, $2,000 for the cars. Let me sell the bikes, yo. Let me sell the bikes, yo. Let me sell, can I sell anything? I'm just checking, I'm just not gonna, not gonna do it. I'm not gonna do it. Oh, that's a pretty cheap way of doing it, honestly. I gotta mount their tub again, because I feel bad. But you could sell everything that you mounted. And then literally just get away for free. And then they'll be like, wait, honey, where did the tub go? Didn't you pay the guy? Be like, yeah. And he's going to be like, um, well, he he put everything in, but then he sold it afterwards because he said he was 100% done. Do you know anything about this, honey? And he's like, no. Did we just get scammed? Yes, we did. We're not going to do that, though. We're not scammers. We want... Our clientele to be happy and pleased at everything we do. So let's go ahead and put this in here. Because we're good. We're good workers. We are good workers. There you go. Look at that. Oh, fantastic, man. Fantastic. Put a light on. Boom. Ooh. Look at that. 8,000 bucks for that one. All right. Let's do one more job. One more job. How does one accidentally sell a bathtub? You point, you point a selling gun at it, bang, and you sold it. I don't know how, but I feel bad because then they, they, they went through a lot already and then that stuff would go down. Oh boy. Okay. One more job, ladies and gentlemen. If you're hyped for one more job, hit that like button right now. Let's see if we can crush 10,000 likes. I don't think it's possible during the live stream, but let's see it. Hit that like button. Let's take one more job. Ooh. And it's home to redecorate. Necessary extra room, bathroom. Clean up the house, please. Oh. Alright, let's do this one. A few days ago, I bought a house at an extremely bargain price. The price was influenced by two factors. For many months, no one wanted to buy the house, and also a certain unwanted guest lives there. I'm talking about a man who, unnoticed, moved in and stayed there for a few days before he was found by police. This guy made quite a mess during his short stay. Trash, crates, and newspapers are lying on the floor. An unidentified substance covers most of the floors, and it seems that someone threw up on the fridge. Being a, a person who rejects the very sight of the current state of the house, I kindly request you clean up the house I bought, and I would ask you to solve problems with electricity. Oh, okay. Again, I'll read all super chats at the end of the stream. So if you super chat at me, don't worry, I will read them. Uh, maybe I bit off a little more than I could chew for this episode here. Oh, there's a basement. Oh, that's nice. Oh. Oh, assemble electri electricity. What else do I do? I'll screw in a new one there. Turn on the breaker. We good? There we go. This is nice. Alright, you know what? We're going to do this one quick. But this is a hoarder's house. Let's get this broom out. This broom works wonders, man. A broom or a mop does not work on cockroaches. Don't you tell me what I can and can't do. 
Don't you tell me what I can or can't do. There's so much light in my office right now. I need to get blackout blinds so that you guys can't see that. There's literally cockroaches everywhere. I'm stepping on them right now, I think. Do not like, do not want. I'm wearing protective gear, though. Come on. Come on. Clean the walls. Oh, and there's still some grime back here. There we go. And then let's uh, let's pull out the vacuum cleaner. Bite me, roaches! I actually just bought a vacuum cleaner. It should be here tomorrow. I'm more excited about it than I should be. Oh, you guys crushed it with the likes. We're almost at 10,000. That's insane. Thank you so much. Appreciate you. Alright, you guys can't live here anymore, roaches. You destroyed the cockroach nest. Why, oh, thank you. I take pride in destroying the cockroach nest. Alright, let's assemble this plug here. This guy... I'm... I'm... If I don't get paid $10,000, I'm gonna throw cockroaches back out from the garbage. That's what I'm gonna do. Back into his house. That's it. Because... Because we gotta get paid, man. We gotta get paid. Okay, maybe we won't do that. We won't do that. But we're gonna... We're gonna technically own the house if he doesn't pay it. Alright? Well, I learned today that there's people that collect vacuums. And they're very helpful when searching what vacuum to buy. So there's that. Okay, we did 97% of the dirt up there, so... Oh, this is nice. Love how the game lags when you try to remove all the boxes at once. Okay, then. This is really nice, this house. Oh, you know what? Maybe this is it. Maybe there's this... The scum on the, the door here. Oh, that wasn't it. I'm curious, because I do want to complete it all. Don't let the OCD take you over, Andre. Don't let it take you over, bro. Somebody repel me. Say, no, OCD. Bad OCD. Ah, I want to clean it so bad. I just want it to be clean. And it doesn't appear on my radar. <sighs> 600 more clean objects, really. <sighs> I'm gonna have to clean every single window, aren't I? I'm gonna do the small rooms first. Let me squeegee these windows. <sighs> squeegee these windows. I should, you know what? I'm taking out the sledgehammer if he doesn't pay me. We're taking out the sledgehammer. His house is going to get the business if he doesn't pay me. Come on. There we go. Open these windows up. I love how I can't open the windows at my own office, but... You couldn't even see out these windows before. Now we can see that we have beautiful neighbors. Lovely, lovely neighbors. Upgrade your mop. Yeah, I need to do a few more things. Bro, I couldn't even tell where I was for a second. I need to do a few more things before I can do that. It could easily be the scuff marks on the door. Let's just clean all around here. We gotta make sure this is all clean. This is why we have the flashlight on right now. This is this is what if somebody's cleaning your house and they don't have a flashlight on, I'm not saying that they won't do a good job. But what I'm saying is I got a flashlight on and I'm legit, okay? I'm freaking legit. Let me clean you. 93% of dirt. Dirt, where are you hiding? I got that Mr. Clean-ish right now. And I can't find you. 93%. I must be losing it. If I can't find this dirt. Oh. 96%. 100% clean. That's what I'm talking about. That's that Mr. Clean vibe right there. Yeah, oh, wait a second. Oh, uh, no, I for sure thought it was... Oh, that's where it is. <gasps> no, wait, it's not there. <gasps> All right, this one's clean. But down here somewhere, 96%. Are you bloody serious? Where? All 
I'm gonna play it cool. I'm gonna play it cool. I'm not upset that it's 96% at all. <sighs> Why does this affect me so much? I just want it to be all clean, man. I'm gonna leave that alone. I, I ain't got time in my life for that. There's so many bloody cockroaches here. Bloody cockroach sounds really weird. weird. We gotta clean up the mess first or else the cockroaches won't leave. What is this grime behind the sink? Wow. This is why you don't let people move in uninvited. People actually live like this right now. Some, there's somebody probably close to you living like this. Really, really dirty. It could be a multiple factors, multiple reasons why. But you gotta feel bad for them, you know? Let's go ahead and get this out of here. We need, like, pesticides, man. We need pesticides. I need some hefty pesticides. These cockroaches do not quit. They're behind the... F they're behind the bloody fridge. Bro, if even one escapes, we're gonna have an infestation. I destroyed the cockroach nest, so... Oh! Really? I did? I did, game? Alright, still says it's not fully clean, so... 89... 90, oh, 93, 94, 94, don't do this to me game, I, I swear, as the game goes on, like, some of the messes are just impossible to find, so I'm just gonna let it go, for my own health and safety, okay, I'm gonna just let it go, I hope y'all don't mind, that's a lot of grime on this window, that is disgusting, Go ahead and clean this up here. Nice little squeegee job here. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Panda, 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 panda. Alright, squeegee this. Scrub a dub dub. Rubbing in the tub. Scrub a dub dub. This is the most innovative part of this game is this squeegee. The way it moves and everything. Feels like you're actually squeegeeing it. The most realistic squeegee experience of my life. Do you think it's the wind? I don't think the windows count towards dirt, guys. I don't think, but I don't know. I think the windows are its own category. Come on. There we go. See, because it still says 94% dirt. So not sure what it could be. It's probably like behind a counter or something, but I'm not going to worry about it. <laughs> not going to worry about it at all. It doesn't affect me. <laughs> I'm not worried. I'm not worried at all, bro. Oh. I'm not worried at all. I'm not fretting. It does, it's not going to keep me up at night tonight. Don't worry about it. Move the furniture. That's too much work, man. Screw it. He's not even going to notice it. I only notice it because it's a statistic. I'm doing as good of a job as I can. If he wants to pay me a million bucks, I'll, I'll be here all day with a toothbrush. But he's paying me, what is he paying me? 4,000 bucks right now. All right, he's not He's not putting up the cheddar I require to do this type of maintenance work, okay? So that's not my, that's on him. That's on him, brother. Now we're gonna get this, the mop out. There we go. Show him what it is, mop. Black and yellow, black and yellow, black and yellow. Oh, we have to do a, there's a thing over there too. The roof is dirty. Everything's dirty, man. Everything is bloody dirty in this place. What isn't dirty? Look at this bed. What is on this bed? I do not want to know. It says 95% clean. Like, give me a break. I can't even see anything. Oh, there we go. And plug that in. Perfect. Screw it in. Plug this in too. And then put this in too. 
We're going to have to push it back in and screw them. And then put the cover on. Put the plate on. Clean the window seals. Do you think that's it? I don't think... Oh, maybe. I don't think they... Like, they look dirty. It says 100% clean anyway. I don't know how I did that, seeing as I didn't do anything, but... How did I miss this? 97% clean. Okay. This bathroom is a beautiful, beautiful piece of work here. Wonder if I just repainted it all. Would that would probably be way faster than attempting to clean all this grime? I think I have to re put it in the shower here. Yeah, mount devices. Uh, wait. I have to remove trash still too. Oh, I think. There we go. And then let's go ahead. Let's just finish cleaning this area. There we go. Make sure it's all squeaky clean. It says 88% cleaned. Oh, 100% cleaned. Perfect. Uh, let's go ahead and go to the store. Let's buy a shower. The showers are always the hardest, too. That's the funniest part. Top of the fridge. I go look for the dirt. So do you guys like when I stream this game for three hours? I'm thinking I should just keep them to like an hour or when I do one of the things. Just because I don't want the series to get old. I don't want you guys to hate this game. And I'm honestly curious what you think. So let me know in chat. As I put this thing in, the showers take forever. It's not even the shower's fault. I mean, it's an it's a important piece of the bathroom technology, you know? Screw them in. The biggest trouble of this is the four of these that you got to put in. Not the knobs. You only have to put in two of them. But the, the plates at the bottom are really a pain. Bottom and top. The rest is fairly simple. Doesn't need too much instruction. There we go. Three hours. <laughs> Alright, but if they're three hours, would you still watch them after if you missed the live stream? That's my question. Ooh, new handyman skill available. Let's do faster mounting. I think that's important. All right, we're almost done all the house. There's still 98% dirt here. I'm dipping, man. I, I can't deal with the dirt. I can't deal with the dirt. Like, where the heck is it dirty? Please, somebody explain this. It's, it's got to be behind something. Can't be anywhere else because I cleaned everywhere else. There ain't a speck of dirt around here, son. Let's move. You get it ready for this? I'm gonna, I'm gonna move this fridge. Where are you, dirt? Where are you, dirt? Where are you hiding, huh? Here's Johnny. Ain't dirt nowhere. Ain't dirt nowhere, baby. Maybe there's dirt behind here. No, there's dirt nowhere. I'm just gonna leave it. On the front door. Do you think it's on the front door? Whatever, I'm gonna just leave it, bro. I don't need to. 98%. 98 freaking percent. You know what? Screw it. I ain't mad. The window's already been cleaned. All the windows are clean, man. I'm leaving it. I'm leaving it. G freaking G. Everything looks good to me. We just missed one piece of dirt there. And apparently there's one piece of dirt over here. Oh, no, no. We did this one. We, that one's done. We're only missing a piece of dirt somewhere here in this area. The 98%. The outlet? Nah, bro. I don't know what it is. It's something that microscopic. The plug behind the desk.
Top of the fridge. Nah, I think we're... I don't know what it is, dog. Under the coffee table. Honestly, that was probably the best guess. Under the coffee table in a bad guess. Back door. It's in the sink. Radiator. <laughs> I love all the guesses. The shutter. Under the fridge, top of the fridge, plug behind the bench. Nah, it ain't none of those, man. I'm at 98% still. It's got to be the smallest thing ever. Look, it's probably behind this thing. On top of this thing. I don't know what it is. It's none of this. It's none of this. Alright, you know what? We're giving up. 98% is it. It's only 2%. We ain't dealing with it. Pete, wait. I found it! It was on this door! 100% complete! I should get a super bonus. He gave me 5,960 bucks. I'ma take it! I'ma take it and go! I'ma take it and go, man! I was about to leave. I was about to be out of there for life. But I came back and I thought, I saw it, and I saw it, and I came and conquered. I feel like Caesar or something. I feel like Caesar. I'm going to drink this coffee now. I feel good. I feel good about life right now, man. I feel good. I feel good. I look good. That's what it is. It's taking a long time to load. It's very concerning how long it's taking to load right now. As it's loading here, we're going to read some of these super chats. I want to thank everybody for the incredible amount of support. For real, though. Y'all are way too supportive, but I appreciate you. I appreciate you. Welcome to the office if you haven't seen it before. This office looks dope. The ultimate office. Um, again, if you watched and enjoyed this video, make sure you do smack that like button. If you're new around here, hit that subscribe button. Do not forget. And I'll probably be live streaming or uploading a video today. Maybe it's going to be The Crew 2. Maybe it's going to be uh, another game set in space. Or maybe I'm going to do some Fortnite. Maybe I'll do some GTA 5. I don't know. Be on the lookout. Uh, we got a bunch of Super Chats, though. Make sure to go check out the merch. Typical dot store, by the way. Go get your merch right now. You're the real MVP if you go buy merch. Typical dot store. Go. Go. Run. Video's over. Go. Um, we got Dawson Pardu. Yes, finally more house flipper. You know what it is, Dawson. Big shout out to you for the 10. Oregon donor, make the house good. You already know what it is. I hope you enjoyed the final product, Oregon. Uh, Rowry McLeod. Can I get a shout out to you, man? Come on. You, you don't go ask for subs on somebody else's channel, bro. You gotta earn them. Jam Dog. Kid at my school as panini maker, so he sells paninis to other. It's called Dan the Panini Man. But it is not legal to sell food. If not at bake sale. Now he dan the paper towel man. For each towel you get a free panini. Jam dog. He's going to be a businessman that guy. He's going to be a businessman. I want some paninis right now. Shout out to you jam dog. Thanks for the story. <laughs> uh, Blackhawk. Shout out to you for that super chat. Organ donor. Thank you so much for the 15 bro. Big shout out to you. The real Jordan. Appreciate that. Uh, we also have TSM Knight. Shout out to you. Judy Hines. I will play Minecraft again at some point. Be on the lookout. Need for Speed. Glad you enjoyed the videos. Dylan Brogard. Cody Wolf. Are you going to use anything that is colored nut? I try my best to use nut whenever, Cody. Gamer Girl. It's too dark. Need to brighten it up. I hope you like with this finished product how bright it is because I'm a big fan of things being bright too. Uh, Dawson Pardo. Do more jobs on House Hunter. You got it. Uh, Aiden Loverich. My room is blue and gray. Well, good choices, man. Gray minds think alike. Uh, we also have uh, Sam, Sammy C, yo TG, I watch a lot of YouTube and you're by far the most entertaining and my favorite streamer slash gamer. I'm loving this house flipper series. Wait, what? Get it, Sammy! Big shout out to you. Thank you for the 10. Glad you joined the series and your words mean a lot, man. There's a lot of YouTubers out there and for you to say that, it makes my heart feel good, Sammy. Shout out to you. Diesel Fitness, it's because it's the nut color on the metal desk, TG. Oh. Well, that makes sense, Diesel. Thank you for that. Aiden Loveridge says you're the best. Thank you, Aiden. Gamer Bomb, keep up the housework. 
doing great. Thank you, gamer. I'm glad you enjoy my design choices. Xbox Master, pick what you want to pick. That's deep, bro. I appreciate that. That's deep. Organ Donor, appreciate that. Diesel Fitness, again, dark is better because the room's darker, but against the lighter blue, and put a gaming PC on the bigger side. See, there you go. Got it done without even reading that, Diesel. I hope you're here, though. Big shout out to you. Dr. D, man, you're the best. Just want to ask, can you do GTA rapper mod sometime? You're the best streamer ever. I, I think you mean... I think you mean real life thug mod, but I was looking at some mods the other day, man. I'm kind of interested in starting back up real life mod and real life thug mod. So be on the lookout. DTA 5000, shout out to you, Xbox Master. Uh, Diesel Fitness again. My client waiting area over here. Uh, we got uh, Marcel Colon. Forest will be soon. Brady Smith. Not sure if I'll do Forest or Fortnite today. Be on the lookout. Typical Gamer's Biggest Fan. Appreciate the love. Lucas Martin. Uh, not sure when I play PUBG Mobile, but you will know, of course. Are you doing the new missions or car tonight from the Brick Prince, the homie? Um, not sure, man. We'll see, because because the, the, I might have to upload something today. Well, we will see. Shout out to you, Brick. Hope you're on if if we do. AK Mathers. Shout out to you, Eminem. Uh, Rick Sanchez. What do you think UK rights? I have no idea about them, Rick. I also try to avoid any politics at all. So, big shout out to you, Rick, and I wish you all the best for you and your country. Alex Alwyn, shout out to you, the Brick Prince, 2017, let's get it, 2018, aesthetic! <laughs> That's a good one, shout out to you, Brick. That's, I'm, I'm going to use that, aesthetic. Cooper Vlogs, make a bookcase with pictures, not a bad idea, shout out to you, Cooper. Ethan San Diego, love your streams, keep up great work, will do, Ethan. Xbox Master, shout out to you, J Jackson Laming, appreciate that. Greg Widgeland. Appreciate you as well. X Kane with a 15 saying nice video. Glad you enjoyed X Kane. Big shout out to you. VA, the best old electronic music for us, for us, for us, for us, for us. I think my friend wants for us. Shout out to you. It'll be soon. Typical Isaac friend, sick in bed for two days. Well, I hope you feel better soon. Not typical Isaac. I know you will. Feel better soon. I hope you will. But and I know that you're gonna you're gonna drink some vitamin C, you're gonna drink some orange juice. You're gonna do a little exercise, maybe. And you'll feel better soon, my friend. Eric Gomez, shout out to you, Curry30 Jr. with the 10. What's up? Nothing much, just flipping houses, making that paper. You know what it is. Shout out to you. Uh, we have uh, Six who says, I love your streams, man. Keep up the good work. Also, if you hold down shift and scroll, the object will even out so they don't look crooked. Thank you, Six. I figured that out eventually, and I appreciate it because you know my OCD. Getting a little best of me sometimes. Curry30 Jr., the gray looks so much better to me. Well, glad you enjoy it. Glad I didn't go with the brick all the way through. I think the brick just straight at the back over here looks pretty sweet. Cody Peltz, love you so much. TG, you're my favorite YouTuber. You inspire me so much. Start my own gaming channel. Love your streams. Keep the amazing work. Well, I wish you all the best, Cody. And big shout out to you. Glad I could inspire you in any way. Captain Fancy Stash, if you have to find yourself all the way over here in Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania, you have to stop by my shop. The Black Market Dinner is on me. Bro, I have to, I'm going to look that up. The Black Market. Market Pittsburgh. Pennsylvania. I'm going to look that up after, bro. Big shout out to you. I appreciate it. Might have to take you up on that offer. Giant Milani, thank you for sponsoring and welcome to the TG Elite. Truly appreciate support. Enjoy those emotes, my friend. And big shout out to you. Hobbitcraft, play more 50, FIFA 18. I think I have to let FIFA do the other people, man. I used to play it a lot when I was younger, but I feel like I ain't got the skills anymore. And then all the UK people make fun of me and I want to cry myself to sleep. I'm just kidding. Maybe I'll do some more. Shout out to you. Jam Dog. Shows up to a random house, TG. What's up, son? It's me, your dad. Rex everything. Homeowner. Thanks. Well, you know what? That's how we got to do it sometimes. Shout out to you, Jam Dog. Team Previous. Shout out to you. Appreciate the, <laughs> appreciate the super chat and message. Nate the Gamer. The K70 rapid fire is lit. Love the streams. Well, glad you enjoy it, man. I think it's a great keyboard. Hovercraft, shout out to you. Is the force next, says Nate. Um, better cops and fire merch. Well, you cop that fire merch at typical dot store. You already know what it is and not sure what's next, but be on the lookout. PC Gaming, you're the best streamer. I love your streams. Keep it up. Thank you, PC Gaming. PG Gaming, shout out to you. Zach Coasters, you inspire me, bro. Thank you so much. Glad I could inspire you in any way, Zach. Big shout out to you. Jam Dog, flip house to get money. Get it? I do get it. That's it's like flipping a couch. I think I think maybe we got the same joke. I don't know. Brian Sullivan, thanks for the tip. Deb Bond Bond, do another arc series? Maybe. We'll, we'll look into that. Thunderboy907, been subscribed since 2015. I love the streams. Well, glad you enjoy them, Thunderboy. Big shout out to you. Thanks for sticking with me. Andy White, you got this. 
when I see you playing, love it. And he's got the hype emote that only sponsors could do. Andy, shout out to you, brother. Brent Walker, appreciate that. Sean Scott with the 10. Thank you, my friend. Ricardo Templos, shout out to you. Sean Scott again. 901 Corey, when are you going to play Friday the 13th again? I should play it again because they updated it. So be on the lookout for that. Sean Scott again. And then we got Cody Wolf. Do you know when you might stream later? Not yet. So just make sure you subscribe, turn on those post notifications, or follow me on Twitter and I'll let you know over there. Thank you, Cody. And then we got Xbox Master. Read my words. <laughs> when, when are you in? Oh my gosh, Xbox. Bro, whenever it happens, it happens. If it happens, it happens. If it doesn't, it doesn't, bro. Yoku75, shout out to you as well. Appreciate all the support and love, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you to each and every one of you. If you want to go cop some merch, typical.store is the spot to be. Thank you for almost 10,000 likes during the live stream. I don't know how much we're going to hit during the um, after it becomes a video, but looking forward to all of you guys uh, checking out the next episode of House Flipper, which should be in a few days. So that's going to be it for this one. Make sure to like the video if you enjoyed it. Subscribe for new. Jordan Gomez says, best YouTuber. Thank you, my friend. Appreciate the kind words. I hope you enjoyed The Office. Now we have 73K to work with, which means, <clears throat> drum roll please, we could actually purchase with 73K um, the home and car. We could get a car. So there's that. We could do it. Maybe I'll title the next one, my first car. Meh. We'll see. That's going to be it for this one, though, ladies and gentlemen. I'll see you in the next stream. Thanks for watching. Hope you have an awesome day, and peace out.